Welcome to another amazing five minute auto pairing. Uh, so, Psycho Cowboy, I think that's GM Simon Williams. Uh, let's try it, Knight C3. And G5. Okay, can I play D5 here? We'll just, uh, yeah, let's try this D5. Maybe knight takes d5. It's not too terrible. We're just taking and then e4. Trying to open up the position a bit. Maybe f4, knight f3. What about f5 and bishop c4? Uh, that's an interesting to try and control d5. Try and control that d5 square. That seems to be on the back foot with bishop c8 a little bit. Um, just queen d2 or h4. H4 for a laugh. I can take an A3, Queen E2. Uh, actually, Knight D5 might have been. Uh, I don't think so. I've got a castle. Surely I've got a castle. Bishop C3 is also potentially really dangerous. Uh, if I castle Bishop C3. Takes us knight f2, winning the exchange, and this is king's compromise. And let's we'll just take this for a moment. What about bishop d5? Just trying to hold that d5 square. Uh, it still looks it looks fairly okay uh, in some respect. Castle over here. Can I not just take that? Hope for the best. Uh, rook f4. I think uh, that is probably too dangerous. Uh, bishop h4 after. There's f6. f6. That would that give me. Bishop takes f6. Uh, rook f3. Try and get the g file open. Okay, let's do this. Uh, because I'm thinking I can get my rook to g file with rook f3 takes and get the rook to the g file. That crazy logic there. <laughs> Test that one. Oh dear, oh dear. Uh, uh, nope, uh, it's not not so amazing at the moment. Although these pawns, I don't know, g5 coming up. So it takes g5, isn't that, uh, isn't that vaguely interesting? So queen h6, I'll take and then g5. Is he going to do that? I can't see what else he's doing here. This kind of justifies my piece sack. If I can get g5 and then f6. Well, now I'm liberating his bishop though, but I'm sort of ruining that one. Um, maybe h5, h6 is better. Well, g6 for f6 and g7. Uh, I can keep the tension there. I was going to use that g file. Oh, hang on. Have I given him uh, too much here? Let's just. Put the king over here for a moment. Keep the tension. Maybe, maybe the pawns are okay to keep. Try and keep. Uh, although now I'm going to regret his bishop. I 
Oh, he's giving up his bishop, yeah. Okay. Yep. Um, this h file, rook h5, might be useful. I can take. And bishop takes b7. Um, is that useful? And take on a6. It's got g4 coming up, that's too dangerous. Uh, what about bishop e6 instead then? Oh no, hang on, a5 instead. I don't want to create his, give his bishop uh, too much scope. Really, I think f6 might be interesting. Okay, um, now he's, he's getting my counterplay down a bit. Oh, king g2, bishop takes over here. B3, let's try B3. Alright, so if I take rook h8, bishop, what about bishop e6 where I'm attacking and then knight d5? Where can this knight go? It can't go anywhere. I can threaten bishop takes d7 for knight d5. King e4. Hmm. It's a bit committal. There's bishop. There's bishop c6. Let's go Check. Knight. Bishop. I saw that trap. I thought you'd see it. Right, so I've got a dangerous pawn over here. Um, knight f6. Knight b6. Well, check first. Check. Well, this looks good for f6, f7. Blimey. I think he's messed it up. Yeah, he's messed it up. Blimey! <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, it's anything happening in five minutes. So I was okay here, apparently, even with h4. The engine likes bishop h6 actually. Bishop f6. Better. Queen f4. <clears throat> Although here the advantage is, yeah, quite significant for black in theory. But not after queen f6. g4 is okay. So I'm sort of almost in the game here. It's almost equal, the evaluation. h5 was actually a good move. So f6, maybe I was right, I'm giving this bishop scope didn't need to do that keep the tension going a bit more g6 apparently okay or king f2 hang on what i played was king f2 <laughs> h6 here now if bishop h8 then g6 Check. i was worried about this one what happens here oh, it's a mate in Check. seven wow Check okay mate. i didn't see that actually i was wondering about that so here i'm better again i didn't know i was better three four five three Four, five, but I'm better according to the engine. So I could have taken, I was worried about the g4 after. So if he took here, I thought this was too dangerous because of g4, because of rook h3. Doesn't this do anything? Check. King g2, maybe it doesn't do anything. Knight f3, isn't this dangerous? Check. I thought this was too dangerous. Hmm, okay, and here, Didn't, did I lose a significant advantage here after bishop c6? Rook a d1, oh rook a d1, okay. What I played was, yeah, he just, for some reason, just took this e pawn, I thought it was just bishop c6 and it was okay. So king g4, now if he took here, What's going on here? Why is white better? So he goes here. I'll take rook h6. Okay, maybe. That looks as though white's. I think this f pawn's too dangerous here. Check. Yeah, he's just blundered a piece. Check. 
Okay. Hope you enjoyed it. Comments or questions on YouTube? Thanks very much.